I'm Chris with Metters Musings, Toys, Tech, and more, back with part two of how to know what's in every bag of the LEGO Simpsons minifigures series number two. So I went to the LEGO store this morning, as you saw in my hunting video, and I got what I believe to be are the last five that I need. So let's go through and see how you figure them out. Now the first one, holy cow, that's really simple. Hans Molman, actually the LEGO store. What they do at some Lego stores is they'll have a little bin behind the counter and they'll have actually a couple of packs open. So if they have the figure you want, you just pick a random uh, pack from whatever they're selling. You pay for that pack, you trade that pack in for the one that you want, and they had the Hans Molman, one of the ones I need. So for this figure, all you're gonna be doing is you're gonna feel, first of all, like I said in the last video, feel for those short legs. Once you find a short leg one, then you're gonna try to find this printed tile piece, which is his uh, driver's license that says Boyd. So yeah, yeah, really simple to find him, but let's move on to the other ones that I have packs for. And this one should be Selma. Remember last video we got Patty. So for Selma, you're again, you're gonna wanna feel for the hair. Selma and Patty, really easy to figure out because of their hair. They got that big, big hair. Of course, for Selma, you're gonna be looking for the eye chart, which is a square tile. So let's just cut this open. Make sure that this is indeed Selma. Open it up. And there we go, indeed this is Selma. Like I said, the big hair and then the tile piece, the eye chart. Let's move on to the next one. We've got the Professor. Now the Professor, he's a pretty easy one to figure out too. You know, here I am again saying they're so easy and yet before I said how hard it was to figure out the Simpsons ones. But once you start feeling them and you get a good idea for it, it really is simple. So for the Professor, the first thing and the only thing you need to feel for is his little beaker. It's very unique very easy to find in the pack so let's dump it out and yes we do have the professor I really like this one he's got a cool jacket and uh, the beaker is really cool as well all right moving along groundskeeper Willie now for this one the thing you're gonna want to feel for is his plunger it's the only Simpsons figure that has like a long rod and then the plunger piece at the end is very uh, mushy let's say that so let's open this up <laughs> make sure that this is in fact groundskeeper Willie and yes it is groundskeeper Willie like I said the plunger right there and as you can see I was kind of feeling it and it's kind of got all smooshed but yeah there's groundskeeper Willie and lastly the one that I'm super excited about, the comic book guy. I really like this one. The one I, because I, the reason I like it so much is because of the accessory he has the squishy cup, which is an all new mold. I absolutely love it. So that's the thing you're going to be feeling for. Don't get it confused with Milhouse's little can of uh, Buzz Cola. The squishy cup has a little round dome and a little straw piece sticking out. So that's really quite easy to feel for. I did get actually confused at the Lego store between this and uh, Millhouse, but the employee at the Lego store did help me out. Let's just dump that out and there we go. Yes, it is the comic guy. As you can see, that squishy cup, so, so cool. You also get a comic there. What is it? That's the Everyman comic. So that's a really cool one. So yeah, as I was saying, what had happened was I'd gone to trade one in to get to the Hans moment and I thought I had grabbed a Millhouse and I gave it to him and he was feeling up and he goes actually you know this is the comic book guy and I'm like well you know I'll just take that one as well because you know I'd love a couple more squishy cups so I took that and then went and grabbed another one and I don't know which one I grabbed for the trade-in but let's just make sure yes there we go again a second comic book guy so now I have two of these awesome squishy cups. So there we go. I hope this helps you out figuring out which Simpsons figures are in which bag when you're out shopping. If you go to the Lego store, there might be a lot of people there looking for them. They can help you. I know while I was there, I was helping out a couple there. They were trying to finish their set, so I did help them out until I found the ones that I needed. The Lego store employee, he was nice enough to feel through the packs that I had given him to put behind the counter while I continued to shop. So, and he felt them up and confirmed them as well. So there we go. That's how you figure figure out which Simpsons figures are in the blind bags for series two. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, a like would be appreciated. It does help me grow this channel. Also feel free to leave a comment. I'd love to hear from you. And don't forget to subscribe. That way you're not gonna miss any videos here on Metters Musings, Toys, Tech and More. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.